Their new spot in Vacaville to get your hand on some delicious fried chicken in its many forms. Senior Vacaville correspondent, her name is Dina Kupfer. She's there live to see if the cane has truly been raised. Hi, Dina. Oh, good morning. And by the way, this is my first live shot in like a year and five months, so bear with me, people, okay? <laughs> I had to make it a nice, fun fried chicken segment, okay? We are actually right across the street from the Vacaville Outlets. If you're familiar with this area, if at the very least you come to Vacaville, you know where the outlets are. Yeah. And that is where the new Raising Canes is. And so behind me, you see they've got an awesome drive through setup where they can have two cars going through with at a time. Lots of signage. You can't miss it. And let me tell you, people, you also are going to smell it from a mile away. It smells like mm -mm, fried chicken. And I'm just uh -huh. going to follow this guy in. Hello, sir. Do you mind if we just follow you? Thank you. Stalker. I can get the drink. You, you can go straight lady. ahead. Yeah. We won't interrupt your breakfast. There we go. Oopsie. Oh, hi. Thanks, everybody. Okay, so this is a Raisin Cane's. If you've never been inside of one, they are awesome. And they are also catered to the communities in which they are erected, which is really special. So we'll talk more about that as we make our way through. But first, let me walk on over to Lisa Toth, who is the regional leader for the restaurants. Good morning to Good you. Good morning. Thanks for having us. Okay, so first of all, Raisin Cane's, if no one's been here, what is it? Well, it's chicken fingers. We start, we have one love, and it's our quality chicken fingers. It's uh, chicken tenders, and it's premium, uh, marinated for at least 24 hours, hand breaded, dipped in uh, seasoned breading, and uh, cooked to order, super fast, super fast. And I can actually hear Cody Stark back in the studio going, mm, 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 bring me some back. Um, the other thing I really wanted to highlight is you all have Texas toast. Okay, Texas this is this is not just a regular restaurant with fried chicken you have a little something extra yes we do have uh, it, every meal is served with our Texas toast uh -huh. at, that is uh, grilled to order as well cooked to order and coleslaw made in-house our fresh sauce is also made uh, to order daily it's a little uh, tangy but a little bit of spice full of flavor yum, yum our fresh uh, Lemonade is squeezed fresh daily as well. I love that. And there's also a little sweet tea because you got to have the sweet tea. Okay, this is the fifth location in our region in the Sacramento area. So this is number five. And across the country, this is really popular too. But in California, you guys are somewhat newer. Yes, well, we've been in Southern California for about seven years now. We just started coming into NorCal uh, last November. And this is our fifth location in Northern California, which is awesome because it's my hometown here in oh, Vacaville. Yes, yeah. I like to call it Vaca Vegas, Lisa. Oh, Vaca can you Vegas. say it? Can you say Vaca that? Vegas. Vaca Vegas, 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 baby. And speaking of which, we've even got we've even got Elvis on the wall, Davy. If you we look this do, way, we see. Do. We have Elvis <laughs> in all of our locations. <laughs> yes. Also, our founder Todd Graves is a big Elvis fan. I love that. And you'll notice too, every location is catered to the community. So we've got a shout out to Will Seawood over there, the Wildcats here in Vaca Vegas. The Wildcats. And then there's a couple other little nuggets that you will see if you come on in on the inside and check it out. And you can also have a little dance party with the disco ball. Um, Lisa, thank you so much for having us. Thank you so much for coming. Cheers to a grand opening last week. And if you are in the Vacaville area, come early because I will tell you, my husband tried to come Saturday night. The line gets pretty long for fried chicken on a Saturday night. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have all the info on where this is located on the screen for you and on our website, gooddaysacramento.com. Back over to you guys. And I'm going to eat some fried chicken Go if you don't it. mind. Go for it. Can you okay. bring some?